Okay, we are rolling. Hey everyone, uh, this is Patch Productions here, and um, so this is my first commentary video over one of my short films. Like I said before, I will be making commentaries for some of my short films. Uh, it's basically where I talk over the movie, you know, talk about some of the things that go on in it, some of the meanings behind it, what it was like during production for the film, things like that. So, uh, as you can see, this is The Mysterious Death of Jacob Hansen. I'm not going to make a commentary for every movie that I make, but I'm going to make a few for a couple of them. Uh, I hope you guys don't mind me. I'm talking a little bit lower in tone right now because it's late at night and I don't want to wake, you know, my parents up and stuff. So, I'm talking a little bit lower in tone. So, I hope you guys can still hear me. Um, so, but yeah, so this is my first commentary video. Uh, I know it's, I know it's not, it might be a little bit different in the future. You know, I, I don't really want to show my face because that's not really that important. As long as you can hear me and the volume's off on the movie so you can't hear the volume of the film. Um, so yeah, but if you want to go check out The Mysterious Death of Jacob Hansen, if you have not seen it already, you can go ahead and back out of this video and actually go watch the movie. I'll put a link to the description. I'll put a, ugh, I'm sorry. It's late, guys. Come on. I'll put a link to this video in the des description. Um, anyway, so without further ado, let's go ahead and begin the commentary of this movie. So let's go ahead and start. Alright, so the Patch Productions logo. The Mysterious Death of Jacob Hansen. Alright, so the movie, uh, let's see, hold on. Hold on, Lucky. I got my dog freaking out on me right now. Okay, so, uh, we obviously have the logo that comes up that I had to create because I edited this movie on my own. This was the first Patch Production film, so it's got a lot of nostalgia to it. Uh, so here's the logo. I tried to keep, I tried to keep it dark looking because it's a horror film. And, uh, as you can tell, if you watch the video with the volume, the actual, um, the noise that in the Patch Productions presents, like right here, the, uh, actual noise that plays is actually kind of scary because this film is a horror movie but it is also a mystery film as well it's about 50 percent horror 50 percent mystery so <laughs> the page i'm sorry guys i got my dog lucky trying to get attention hold on buddy hold on all right so that's the logo and then the mysterious at the jacob hansen i really didn't think of how the logo was going to look for the title of the film uh i know it doesn't really look that dark maybe the background red colors but the uh the letters and the color and the letters the blue it doesn't really look that horror aspect like uh the background does a little bit it's not really that dark but like i said i wasn't really thinking much into how the title went okay so here's jacob hansen coming out of the bathroom he obviously is already taking he's taking a shower uh his parents aren't home he turns on the light in his bedroom and he goes to sit to, uh, you know, watch TV, because he's, he's just chilling. So, actually, about this scene is, um, I had to prop up my phone. I didn't have a tripod or anything, so I had to chop, I had to adjust my phone. I had to prop up my phone on my chair, because I was filming this with my phone. Uh, I was also, I've also filmed all my other movies on my phone so far. Uh, but I filmed this one on my phone, and so... I took a shower, like, realistically, I actually, I actually took a shower, and then I, <clears throat> I got out, and I actually went, and I sat down, and I was gonna watch one of my favorite shows, which was Stranger Things, I was binge-watching it, <coughs> and I, um, I decided, I was like, I have my Pets Production channel already starting, and I was like, you know what, let me go ahead and make a movie, so I got up, and I was like, what kind of film should I make? And so I went back in the bathroom, you know, I propped up my phone, and I was like, okay, uh, so let me go out of the bathroom and make it seem like, you know, I took a shower. So yeah. So yeah, here's Jacob Hansen walking out after taking a shower, which is kind of true. Like, literally, this entire scene from right here, <clears throat> all the way to, um, Play the, play the show. Or Jacob Hansen goes. And I accidentally turned on the other TV in the background, as you can see. 
So basically, this entire scene right here from the very beginning, except for the noise, me looking around, um, this scene is actually, this scene literally really happened to me. Like, true story. This scene happened about five minutes before I decided to make the movie. Because like I said, I was chilling and my parents weren't home. And I was like, you know what? I don't want to watch this show right now. Let me go ahead and make my first film for the channel. So as you can see, I'm sitting. So I'll go ahead and turn on TV. If you listen carefully, I accidentally had the Japanese subtitles or the Japanese, yeah, the Japanese subtitles on. So the actual volume coming out of the the actual volume coming out of my TV, the uh, language was actually in Japanese. So if you listen closely when you watch the movie, the language is in Japanese. So it's kind of like you know, oh dang. And then I changed it when I pulled, when I edited the movie. This film was actually filmed like at night on uh, J July 28th, 2019. So it's actually pretty cool that it's uh, June 2020 now. You know, it's almost it's nearly a year. Like, what is today? Today is the yeah, today's the 19th. So it's about a year. Like right now, it's about a, it's 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 about a year since this movie came out. So it's actually pretty interesting because I was. I was 16 when I made this movie. I'm 17 now. So I hear the noise. I'm curious. Or Jacob Hansen hears the noise and he's very curious. I accidentally paused the TV twice. I paused it right there. And then I paused it. Like, watch, watch right here. I pause it. To listen again. And then I go for a second time to pause it. But Jacob Hansen's curious because he hears all these noises. That's my bedroom, by the way. Now normally if you heard a scream in your house, you wouldn't act that chill about it, but this uh, foot scene, I know it seems kind of funny, but it's actually, I was trying to get a really good camera angle. And as you can see, if you watch real quick, like, alright, so here goes Jacob putting in his shoe, putting his shoes on. And you see my shadow, right? Watch. See it? Come back. That was my shadow. I was coming back to grab my phone to stop it. Alright, so here I am, out in the hall, curious to know where that noise is coming from, and if you watch the movie, you can actually hear the, the music tense up as suspense. Uh, it's actually the Jaws theme, but the scene is really interesting because it's like, okay, I'm coming out of my bedroom and there's a light shining out into the hallway, and then I'm walking into the darkness. It's because the movie starts out, you know, I'm like, happy, I'm chilling, I'm watching my movie. Or I'm watching my show, you know, it's it's bright, it's 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 happy. And then slowly throughout the movie, Jacob goes into, you know, the, the Jacob dies at the end of the movie because he's curious about what's going on. It's like what I'm trying to explain is uh it's difficult to explain, but the movie's it starts out happy and then it goes really dark because Jacob dies. So Jacob is right, let's see, it comes around right here, Jacob goes into the hallway, and ascends into the darkness like he's about to die, it's foreshadowing for him, so see how it's all bright, and then he ascends into the darkness, and the hallway, that hallway scene is a, a resemblance to the thumbnail scene, because the thumbnail scene, Jacob is opening a door, and there's light behind him, as it seems like he's walking into the darkness, because he opens a door into a dark room, which is actually my bathroom, which is that door, that door right across from the bedroom door that's opened. Um, but the door is actually opened, and it's like it's a resemblance to this hallway scene because the scene, the the picture in the thumbnail is that never actually happens in the film. Like the picture in the thumbnail never actually. It's never shown in the movie. It's just that this hallway scene kind of resembles, kind of resembles that. Yeah, this hallway scene kind of resembles that thumbnail picture. So Jacob's curious. He's going and ascending into the darkness to figure out what's going on. Lights up. The camera was uh, he's curious to know what's going on. He looks around. Let's see. 
So my my phone was actually right where I'm standing. That's the hallway. Uh, the phone was kind of propped up where the door is, as you can see to the left. The camera was actually propped up there, shining showing down the hallway. So Jacob look Jacob looks around, <clears throat> and uh, there's nothing. There's my bed. There's Lucky laying on my bed. And then I was like, you know what, I'm going to let Lucky be in this movie because he wanted attention like he does right now. So yeah, I'll let Lucky decide to be in the film because he wanted attention. Literally how he's acting right now is how he's acting in the film because he really wants attention right now. He's trying to get in the chair. So I turn off the light to go back in the bedroom. Another, that turning off that light switch was a, um, another resemblance of how the movie starts out bright, happy. And then goes into darkness as I die. Or Jacob Hansen dies. So Jacob goes back into the bedroom and he has a seizure. Out of nowhere. Or, yeah, like a heart attack or something. A stroke, maybe. And he just passes out. Or not passes out, he dies. And then that's supposed to be my his house at night. And a dark looking theme. That's actually not my house. I, I pulled that picture off of uh, off the internet. But... Yeah, I don't really, I think he has like a, uh, I haven't really clarified or confirmed what happens to Jacob Hansen in the scene. I think he just has a stroke or something. But like I said, it's a mysterious death, so no one knows why he died or really how he died. Uh, and then the credits come up. It's kind of sad that he died, so it's got, uh, it's got, you know, it's got the sad music playing and, you know, written and directed by Dominic Petch. The credits, like I said, I wasn't really thinking of how the credit design would look because as you can see the credits look kind of bright and joyful i wasn't really thinking of I, when i when i was writing the credits i wasn't or creating when i was editing the credits and making them i wasn't really thinking about making them dark i just made them look whatever you know the only the only oh shoot i didn't mean to click that video hold on guys okay i'm back so, like I said, I wasn't really concerned, like, I was only concerned about how that looked. I wanted that to look dark, because if you, as you've seen on Careless Starvation, the Patch Production logo, or Patch Productions Present logo, is not dark looking like that. And then the title isn't really that dark. And then, the credits aren't really that dark. And then there's the watermark. So... Yep, that is the movie, and, uh, you know, it, it's, it's kind of cool because it's like, uh, you know, my first film I ever made on the channel, and it's like, wow, because, uh, you know, it's about to be a year since this movie came out, and I feel like I should make, like, an anniversary or a sequel to it, as you can see, it's got over 249 views with 10 likes. You know, there's the description for it, which was fun to write, July 28, 2019. Uh, but yeah, guys, so I really hope you enjoyed this commentary for The Mysterious Death of Jacob Hansen. I really hope you enjoyed the movie of it, the short film. You should definitely go check it out. It's a horror mystery movie. And yeah, guys, definitely go follow me on Instagram. I'll put my Instagram link in the description below. As, as, uh, and I will also put this film link in the description below so you can actually go watch this movie for yourself anyway guys i really hope you enjoyed this commentary and stay tuned for more commentary videos coming soon and also stay tuned for future movies and future vlogs all kinds of future content coming on patch productions channel i know this video is a little long i didn't mean for it to be as long as it is it wasn't my intention but it oh well you know anyway guys so i really hope you enjoyed this this commentary and stay tuned for more, and I will see y'all in the next video. Later guys, thanks for watching. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe.